Hello everybody, welcome to a new modern video. I decided to brew a deck, usually I'm a net decker, but today I was like, oh, I wanna play Quest and Druid. This card sees quite a bit of playing Legacy, and why does nobody play it in modern? Um, the goal of this card, as well as Ren's Resolve and Reckless Impulse, is that you want to play as many cheap spells as possible. So you see here, 24, uh, one drop with a removal spell, creatures, and of course Mishra's Bubble. Uh, the green side of Question Druid is quite good in this deck because it's mono red. And I have one Underworld Breach only in case like you get to this like super long game where you just divination it forever and you just find this and you just go like, you know, bolt bolt or whatever. Or you just go like a couple of Swift Spear and a lot of bubbles and you win. Uh, 20 lands, my previous version had 18, but I think that uh, that's too little and this deck actually is very man hungry. Like you want to get to four lands often and uh, yeah, and I added X extra land to Canyon, so, you know, I guess maybe we should just go, like, we should just play instead, just three Canyons and just another, another fetch land. Yeah. Maybe not Mountain. So let's just go, let's just go six Mountains. Um, yeah, the sideboard is kind of random, honestly. Living Gand, the Sanctifier and Vec, Rhinos. A Chalice of the Void, or is a Saga? That's kind of like uh, the um, the cards that you are targeting with those ones. And let's go through a league. Eddie Chang for round two. Keep on keeping one landers so that then I can complain that I got unlucky. Well, this has like four shots at finding a second land on turn two in my 20 cards deck. I think it's reasonable. Okay. Playing against Gobos. Some lava darts in our deck. Be nice to draw them. I guess first land. Okay, good. Mm, I don't attack. Sorry, I don't block. Maybe should have. Draw. I can go DRC Bolt. This way I'm very likely to hit Delirium. No, top for three. Binning the land there is awkward, but at the same time, it gives me Delirium now. So I'm dealing two extra damage this way. Goblin Matron. Okay, let's see what I grab. Conspicuous noob, okay. Good. I think I like to unholy heat the skirt for a specter now. Maybe I actually should keep the unholy heat for uh, the conspicuous noob. Yeah, I'm just gonna go soul star mage. Here I got three DRC, like those are packing damage. I put a King Combo in the same turn. They don't have haste to do the Conspicuous No Plus um, Bogart Harbinger combo. Mogwar Marshall. Okay, this gives them. One extra mana, it's like a paretic ritual, basically. Okay, munition expert. All right. 
Do they also play the conspicuous noob? Yeah. And they have another munition expert on top. That's good to know. I wish I didn't see it though. Uh, I think I'm going to upkeep and only heat this. Another lining bolt. Is this good? Attack you down to five. Yeah, I guess. You can kill one of my three threes. Lineable puts it to two, and if you kill one of those, um, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Yeah, I don't know if I want to. Like, I could hear Lining Bolt the Scarf Prospector, and then the Munition Expert won't work. I wonder if it's better to hold the two bold face. All right, they concede. <laughs> Okay, now sideboard. I probably don't cite anything. Yep. Maybe I cite in out one breach for one spell bomb. Okay, let's begin. This is, I guess, Goblins, game two. I have, uh, not the best hand, but it has lands. Oh, little on the moment. Okay, then. My DRC will be a Forever 1-1. One, one. Thank you, Georgino. Forever 1-1. One, one. That's what DRC is. Land, 1-1. One, one. Go. I got my one scalding tarn. Hmm. All right, Nether Shriek Maw. It's okay. I'll take it. It's Nile. Uh, I'm going to play my Divination here. I think it's better using my mana. Lift, love it, art. Okay. Can't use the flashback, but it's still decent here. Trades. So they do. That goblin matron. This is new. Mm. And they will land on top. You know, kill this noob. Gonna go just like kill, kill, kill this turn. Let's go. So it's mage. Let's go Anoli Heat. Let's go Lava Dart. I need more divinations. What's that double black? Oh, Parker Armager. Sure. I put a thing on top. Could be what ringleader. The leader of the rings. There it is. Drop divination. There it is. Let's go. I flip more divination. Very nice. Do I want to do something else? Nah, probably. I just go divinations. 
Tac, tac, tac. Mm -hmm. Flip. Maybe nation you are saying. Okay. But I can rank me now, but I feel like this is the type of game where uh, you're just super happy to play with this deck, just hitting land grabs and divinations. Our opponent did a clean draw four with their ringleader. That's good. Attack me for four. Yeah. Let's go for DRC and Brent's resolve. Surveil, bubble, all in on top. Let's play bubble, surveil in the graveyard. Now what? I bubble myself. I see a canyon. I'll shuffle that away. I don't want to draw a canyon. Now what? Do I want to use this lineable somewhere? I, use, I can use it on this noob later. I probably should use it on this noob later. Let's go Soska Mage, attack. This is not Seek the Beast, this is Ren's result, so I can cast it until my next turn. Draw. Make sure it's bubble, okay. Skirk Prospector, sure. And I can play Munition Expert, sure. It's gonna deal, uh, it's gonna kill something. That one, okay. I'm happy to block the Bogart Harbinger. And I think I also want to kill the Ringleader. Lava Dart. Probably fine on top. There's a Ley Line, so putting the Graveyard is not as good as it would normally be. They play Snoop. Draw. Maybe this was bad though. Maybe I should have uh, bottomed this. I don't know. Pull myself and another removal spell. Okay. I'll kill that. I'll kill that. Play land, return Giganta. That for four. Draw another burn spell. You have a land on top. Five lands. What's that? Matron, okay. Okay. Uh, what do I do here? I can also just bolt face. Do I rather kill things or bolt face? What's better? I guess I'm killing things. I'll play Giganta and hold up Lightning Bolt. Mm -hmm. Yep. I reveal another land. 
good to know. What next? That's they have one card in end. Bogart Harbinger. Uh, that's fine, right? Yeah. Doesn't have haste, so. Two to put on top. Kikijiki might actually be annoying here. And just they draw it and cast it. I could uh, just untap and go, okay, they put on top Goblin Matron, sure. Then I'm just happy to bolt this end of turn. Maybe I had so much mana that I shouldn't have done it. Okay. Divination have been found. Two lands, okay. Uh can attack it all and play Western Druid. If my opponent goes a matron into Chieftain, I could just block one. And I'm not dead, so yeah, I think this is good. Plus this is lethal, so they have to block. Say this deck doesn't flood and mostly screws. So maybe just playing more lands isn't a, isn't a problem. I guess it does flood in your opening end, like if you don't have a good start. So maybe by playing too many lands, you open the worst hands. Mm. Could be. Wow, oh, well, sure. When it gives a good old trade, Western Druid and pass to you. Okay. I could both. Don't worry. Okay, round number three, playing against uh, Giganta Mirror Match. Playing a Giganta Mirror Match. I'm going to go Bobble myself. Okay, I see a Swift Spear. I think I like that. There was a land I would have shuffled. I could also have the Bubble to pump this, but I think it's wrong. I think I'd rather. Put a multi five or the playing Tron or Steerings. No, I'm with it. 
Okay, so that is the amulet that uh, doesn't play Titan, but plays the Timeless Lotus instead. Go on double creature here. Yeah, tap for two. Okay, draw. Let's seek the beast. And flip. Land bubble. Very good, actually. And gardens. And then I bolt you. And that's 12 damage. You have 3 life. Okay, so opponent is at 3 life. I don't have any more burn spells. Let's see. They can seat. Sweet. I probably want to bring those in, taking out Love Arts. Their deck shouldn't play any creatures, if I'm not mistaken. I believe they like a single a single player top eight did a couple of challenges last weekend with this deck. So let me see. <sighs> yes, screen writer and why. Oh no, yeah, Golos, Grazer. Hmm. Okay, do I want to keep the Anoli Heat? Anoli oh, Heat seems pretty bad, yeah. Do I want the Explosives? I guess Loud Art is still alright. Maybe like heals a Grazer if they block my 1 2. So Spike played yesterday? Alright then. If Spike played it, it's this deck then. Okay, Alpine Moon. Keep. Art Force Syrinx. Oh, great. All of those Alpine Moon, not great. I don't mind one. The name is a saga. I better than only heat anyway, so. Okay, Simigur Chamber. Forest again. Grazer. Wow, they don't play. See me grow chamber. Madonna mia, my yeah. There's a reckless impulse off of that. I think I'm gonna bottom it. Oh, no. Two lands. Yeah, we won't get one. Okay. Should have played our Meza. To find Delirium. Alright. I am going to name Simigro Chamber. But that they don't have the bounce land.
Of course, they can have another bounce line and I lose, but I feel like this is my better chance. Okay, so they have three cards and they pass. Okay, now I'll go Alpine Moon. See if they make us in Garden Copia response. Yeah, prize I need to find the Lyrus. I have to I have to graveyard this. I want to name another bounce land. Let me see. Or Gruel Tour. So I'm gonna name that. And then what? Do I play another Alpine Moon? I guess so. Okay, Lightning Bolt. Maybe this is all right. Nah, I'll, I'll find a divination. All right, so my opponent should have uh, four Saga, one Silesnia Sanctuary, one Golgari Rot Farm. I don't want to name those. I guess I'll name her as a Saga. E let's attack. End of turn, love it art. No, actually, upkeep love it art is better. Okay, that's another lightning bolt. How much damage is this? So this is 12. Uh, 6? Yeah, that should be lethal if they don't have anything. All right. Pretty sure that Alpine Moon stopping uh, the bounce lands got me the game. Okay, let's go. Perfect. Lands and spells, that's a dream. Let's go, land the RC, pass to you. Okay, play against the scam. I think it's good though, I don't mind playing against scam with this hand.
Okay. Draw. I'll play Brian's Resolve, that's the Lyrium. Actually, this is very good, right? Yeah. Reveal land perfect, land channeler. Wooded foothills. Oh, so I'm playing at Scamzu. It's not Scam, it's Scamzu. Much better. Okay, do we have Kabu? They do. It's not black enough damage over there. Go land, DRC, attack, pass. You go to eight. Then I can go questing druid at your end step. Surveil a bolt, win the game. You can attack and remove me delirium. Yeah, I don't think this deck is that bad against Scam. We have so much card advantage. All right, so what it take? Sorcery, probably. Oh, the discard draw. We can be dead. Um, it's hard for them to kill me in this spot. They don't play Tribal Flames. I guess Fury, Fury Scam would be the way I die. Or I guess Double Bolt, that's also likely. Yeah, they go Fury, hopefully they don't have Scam. If they do, I'll be served, totally did. I'll do this. No, you scam? Eesh. Okay, so I have zero permanence now. It's unlikely that I win this game. Two lands, alright, alright, GG. That was a pretty good draw for my opponent. Turn three, <laughs> decent, decent board state. Alright. Now. I am submitting this back. Love it, Ark. Actually, Ark is the orc, so. Let's go. Keep. Land DRC. Go. All right, this is good for me. I'm gonna go Reckless Impulse. Swiss Spear, I'm gonna help. It's gonna help me get Delirium to be in that Swiss Spear. All right, I got that bow master. It's okay. With that bow master. Okay, now what I can do here is land DRC, bolt. I like bubble. 
I guess I can do like upkeep questing druid. Maybe. They evoke fury. Okay. Pitching Kabu. And if they're trying to scam, I got that on only heat ready. And there was Sino Draco, it's alright. Upkeep of Lake Western Druid because they know the top. Revealing Bubble Land. Okay. Then I can go Land Bubble. Now the question is do I want to play Western Druid or an Oli Heat? I guess I'll play Western Druid, it's just more mana efficient. Or I could, no, yeah, I think I like that, yeah. Black Western Droid. Oh, top is another Fury, okay. Too many lands, unfortunately. I need to draw my Divinations. Or Sign of Draco's. Need to draw more divinations, please. It is so there, porca merda. Bro. Could be anything. It could even be... Ooh, I know the heat. Nice. I know the heat there. Attack for three or stay back? Should I trade damage? Three, they have lifelink. Mm. I guess I'm attacking, yeah. But I just go land fury. I, mean, I don't have fury yet. I don't know the second card. Okay. Let's see if they draw land. Hope not. What do I hope? Ah, they draw land. Alright, that's three damage at least. So you go to nine. We'll see. It's not over yet. You play Sokenza and Chan block. Like, kill the sign of Drake and play Sokenza. Can they have no cards in end? Attack me for five. I got three. Now. I'll draw. I think I'll play this Reckless Impulse. Find land, Soul Scrimmage. Oh, so I have to chum block Fury, unfortunately. I guess I have to do this. And then your upkeep. Oh, I'll only hit the Scion. It's doable, though. I can win this game.
Andrew terminate. Okay, I go to one here. This reckless impulse needs to deliver. Alright, let's go. Let's find a bolt. I did. Very nice. Okay. So now I survived, which is good. Um, mm -mm. I guess I'm gonna go seek the beast. So I just go. I guess I can also play the face of the face of Druid and make it into a two two. So I don't have to play the Sokanzen or the Slava Dart. And then my opponent breaks. Now I guess I guess the best play is the following. I'll go Bolt. I'll go uh, Lava Dart, and I'll go Sokanzen as a land. Now I can go questing Roy um, as a spell in upkeep. And then and then I basically just drew two extra cards rather than just playing a creature, which I don't think it matters very much. Okay, I found questing droid land. And they pass. Draw. Now I want to play a questing droid first. And then I want to play Seek the Beast. Hmm. Now I can play, I guess I don't want to play Seek the Beast again, I'm just gonna let that one die. I'll play DRC, and I'll bolt you. And next turn I'm able to win the game. Let's hope my opponent doesn't draw a Lightning Bolt or Kish Bowmaster. Even Fury's alright I guess. Leland Binding, okay. Still alive, I guess. Mm-hmm. Uh, do I want to go Love at Art? To Surveil. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's decent, because, like, this one is just, um... Adventure side, and I definitely don't need all of this mana, so I'll do that. Just love it, our face to surveil. Okay, Ryan's words, I'll, I'll leave that on top. Now, let's go. Do I want to play this first? Probably not. I might flip like a lot of these and then find Lightning Bolt as the last one. Okay, Swift Spear. So this is lethal if I find a lava dart. Hmm. How many line bolts have left? One only. And lava dart? Two. It's a lot of lava dart. I'm gonna leave it on top then. Let's see. Mishra's bubble. It's not lethal, unfortunately. If I had lava dart in the graveyard, it would have been lethal though. Anyway. Let's go questing droid. Mishra's uh, monsters to spear. Mishra's bubble. Surveil. What is that? A lava dart that I can find now. Alright, I'm gonna bubble my opponent. I could see death here. Grief. Alright, this should be a win. Oof! Kind of a crazy game that we were able to steal. I even just draw a lot of art now. It's 
Yeah, it was a good game. Oh, it wasn't even game three? I thought this was game three. All right, still. Happy with this win. Very happy with this win. Divination very strong. Isn't sucks, but I'm keeping it regardless. Just needs a land, right? Am I right? Ooh, I draw land. Nice. Let's go land, DRC bubble, ready to, for my DRC to die. Mm, yeah, I think I'm bottoming on graveyard in the land. I might not find it. Ready to go to work, Fish Bowl Master. Do, do, do. No default, that's, uh, that's usual. Oh, wow, top land. Okay. I don't have any art. No, I prefer to buy cards than art. Maybe one day I like I will really like that, but for now I'd rather hang on a wall uh I don't know, like some, some cool cards I own. Rather than some arts. Mm, I definitely want to kill that sign, so I'm gonna go DRC Bolt Dart. Oh, you like this. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, go. I do not play commander. I think I'm gonna start with questing druid. Hoping to find a sorry, seek the beast. I mean to say, Hope to find a noli heat. I don't. I find a soul star mage. I wonder if I should just play it, probably. Because like otherwise it's just going to waste. We can't waste. Oh, uh, you attack me for five. I can do some weird play that involves me love at arting that Kabu. And then blah. Wow. I think I just, I'm actually going to ignore that. I'm going to ignore that. I hope you don't have a scum effect and fury. I feel like if I just do block, it's super risky. I don't know. Okay. 
Okay, they go Fury Evoke. I have two cards in end. I hope you don't have a scam effect. If you do, I'll probably lose this game. No, you probably don't. Nice. The relief. That was a cyan. Mm. One card in end. Okay. I think I want to go questing druid. And just go land go. And then there is a world where I can just go like double lava dart. Things like that. First strike the cow has. Right if they draw a scam effect, they don't draw it. Oh look. Do I go for it now? No, I think I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna go double block. Excel land on the void. Okay, ski fly on the void. Alright. Uh, if I double block. Five, five, that's a three, four, that's a three, three. You can't cast Terminate with that mana. You can't cast Lightning Bolt though. Lightning Bolt blows me out. Yeah, I guess I'm ready to lose if they have it. They have it. Let's go. Love it, Art. She's probably done that last turn, I don't know. I'm gonna play four Lava Darts right now. The Questing Druid becomes a 5-5. Five, five. And we're trading. Okay. Happy. One dart on the Kabu, the druid doesn't die. That's too risky though. I think I'm in okay in this spot. They have the two cards in hand at Reckless Impulse. So Kans and Canyon, you know? Chigantha too. Why double block? Yeah, I should just block with Solska Mage. That was maybe better. It was an easy turn. Like, it all lined up perfectly, but it could have not, you know. What's that? Okay, the RC Brands Resolve. Do I want to just go Brands Resolve? I think so. I can cast this next turn anyway. These effects are so powerful. The two mana draw two. All the value in the world. Eight. Okay, another of these. Reach. Eh, that's okay. 
All right, GG. We win. All right, solid 3 1. I had some doubts at first with the deck, but uh, I guess it's finally drawing well. Oh, wow. Itazu consumes all. That's funny. Okay, though, we have our 1 of Underworld Bridge that's gonna win the game. Bolt. Bolt. Bolt, 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 bolt. Take a bathroom break, come back for the final round. Final match. I would mulligan this hand. It's very rare that I get to mulligan a one lander with a Mishra's bubble. But this hand doesn't have DRC. That means you gotta draw land in the top three cards. And even so, I don't have. Like, maybe if I knew the matchup and this was good, but I in the dark, I think I'm just gonna ship this. Happy with this one. I would love to not bottom anything, but you can't. I think I'm bottoming the Reckless Impulse. Question Drake has proven to be excellent. Okay, what are we fighting? Steam Vents. Okay. Nice. Wish I had that previous hand with two Love at Arts. Little did I know. I was playing against the monkey itself. Man, Ragavan just continuously just just is like just dropping so much. Dropping so much this Ragavan card. Earlier in the previous version of this deck I had two Ragavans in, instead of uh two lands. My Ragavan just died to Orkish Bowmaster every game. It was terrible. Much much glad I much more happy I don't have it actually in my deck. There it is, load art, right on schedule. Maybe I should have just gone bubble myself. Maybe that was better. Just bubble myself first. But then I guess it's bad against spell peers. It's fine. Alright, I'll just pass. I'll go seek the beast and look to earn. Wow, they pass without making a play. I kind of don't want to do anything then. Opponent doesn't have land drops. I don't like the move. They don't have creatures. They don't have land drops. Their hand is just counter spells and removals. I don't want to move. If I if I have land drops, you tax their. You tax their mana this way. They draw land. They got unstuck. But I'm happy to go land brands resolve now. But I have to use a counter spell, not a spell pures. Some big canyon are a little bit annoying. I wish they were normal land, but maybe in the in the next turns I'll be able to draw off of them. Okay, your results actually. Wow, we got land and the RC. Mm -hmm. They pass. Wow. Yeah, I'm not gonna play this questing droid. I want to play around spell peers. Also, they have seven cards. Like there, I have to play that DRC because otherwise my opponent, sorry, otherwise it just goes to waste. But that's it. I don't have to play anything else. It's 
with another DRC. Now, I want to play this quest in Droid around Spell Pierce. Do I want to play it now? Nah. Then I'll let my opponent use the mine in my turn. Okay. Druid land. Let's go for the the quest of Druid. Hmm. End of turn. Seek the beast. Oh, you want to unholy heat that? I just crack this land and I get to delirium. Is it worth it? I think so. I put it will be able to spell pierce this. I think it's all right. The other special way of getting over disappointing tournament finishes. I mean, back in the days, it used to be just uh, you prepare for the next one, you don't think about the past. Now there's like so few tournaments that is harder to do. Okay. Uh, yeah, I like that. Do you spell use this? You spells near that, okay. Wow. Uh, I wouldn't say I agree with my opponent uh, line of place there. I just put a couple of those. Yeah. Maybe you can work on the things you did wrong in the next day. The the current system is so brutal. Like you have one opportunity, one you have one one tournament to do well or you bust. So you can't be upset if you don't get the goal. The goal is unrealistic. Like 24 people out of 700 get the goal, so. You know, you shouldn't set your goal to be, I want to qualify. If I don't qualify, I'm gonna be disappointed. You should, maybe it's the opposite. You're like, oh wow, I got so close to qualify. That's actually sick. But then again, it's just, I'm not good with that. Explain the stand of things. Okay. I'm gonna go with Lava Dart and of Turn. This is an easy game. I'm gonna just only heed that. Sure. I don't know if this is good. Probably it isn't. Actually, given how many of those I have, I don't mind if they spell pierce this. Nah, that's not true. Like before it was easy to be like, oh, whatever, I screwed up. I have another tournament, I have another GP, I have another PTQ. Now it's like, oh, nothing actually for five months so I want to allow it arc you here it's gonna be it's gonna be some damage
Oh, I think I like that. Like, to give you uh, my example, because, you know, it's never easy to put in other people's shoes, but to give you my example, after I busted uh, PT Minneapolis, where, you know, I tested, a, I tested a lot for that, maybe, you know, obviously I didn't test as much as I did in the past, but, you know, considering, considering my job obviously takes a lot of time, I was happy with where I was, and I was like, oh, surely I'm going to requalify only 9.7. Like, you only need 9.7 to requalify, and then I failed, you know. So obviously that was, uh, that was bad, and actually I, you know, I failed to qualify again. I didn't even try to qualify to the European event, and I kind of expected to just be out, you know, just not qualify anymore. But then it happened rather soon, so, yeah, just kind of... Play the game, enjoy the company. Things will happen to you. Okay, I'll uh, submit the same deck list for game two, which is actually going to be the last uh, match of this league. We are doing fine here. We are, we're doing well. Pudo Merktied, always there to deliver wins. Where's this list from? From here. It's from my tiny little brain. It went through some iterations and I have uh, liked it so far. The sideboard is whatever, you know, it's kind of thrown, thrown together. The car quest in Druid has been has been has been good. A three man list? No. Raymond Gaste of Saint Draft. Game two, lands and spells, very nice. You got a new Ragavan? I think it's reasonable to set out Ragavan against the Lava Dart deck. Okay, no relevant. Happy with that. I'm gonna go. Oh, we should I play fetch land. Oh, I might. I might miss the Lyrum because of that. Sorcery, artifact. And if I find an instant here, I would have had the Lyrum. No, okay. Didn't matter. As most thing of in magic. And no, I'll stop there. Alright, steam vents. Oh uh, actually you wanna wait, right? I don't have any reason to Okay. 
memory lapse isn't modern legal. It was for a moment uh, on Magic Arena, I remember, though. I don't even know if it's illegal. I assume it isn't. But also, I have no idea. Yes. Delirium. Okay, iterations. That's good. I'm not playing that card. Do I just go quest in uh, Brand's result? Yeah. They're very happy with their expressive iteration draw. And they slam it. Bam. From the top to the play. Okay, draw. Go DRC. We'll go Mountain again. No. I like to go Questing Droid because in case I flip a land off this and I want to play this, I need the Stomping Ground in play. Remember, that's if you play the Modern? Probably. I don't know. I mean, it was, it was very good on Magic Arena when it was legal. Okay. I think now it's good time to play this quest in Euroid. Because I can cast into my next end step. Which is not this. Right? And this resolves. I can't counter this. We're going to Sophia? Yes. Um do I leave this on top? Sure. So oh more quest in Euroids. Nice. Let's hope they don't have a Merc Tide. Right now I don't have all the anomaly heats like I did in the previous game. Merc Tide. Gonna be hard here. All oh, over. I wanna play Swiss Spear and I wanna play Seek the Beast. And I wanna play Souls Command. And pass. Mm. Got Fury? Oh, no, I can see two Fury. Let's go game three, final game of this video. No changes. Deep analysis, not bad.
Ok. Ce canta? Clip. Like his hand. How do I sequence? I actually wanna play this. Nah, it's okay. I'll play this. Turn on. Mm, no, nah, I wanna get some ATB out of this. I'm gonna go Sweet Sphere. I'm gonna place a ton of removals, but at least I get in one damage. Land Sea Sphere Attack Hmm, you don't have a removal spell. Nice. Okay, you left the card on top. It must be a removal spell then. I have to play my brand's resolve now. Tap for two. Yeah. That one shouldn't be a problem, so let's just go for Brand's Resolve. Revealing Land Quest Druid. Attack pass. You watched the podcast episode? Yeah, that's true. We released the podcast episode late yesterday. It's about Anthony Top 4 Worlds and my Top 8 at the Limited Open. It's on my YouTube channel and on every podcast platform. It's a you listen podcast. It's called Competitive Magic with the Carnies. With the K. Wow, they stay back with the RC. That's wild. I uh, think I'm going to attack. And end of turn, I'll play the Seek the Beast. This way I get to train value for the next turn. And I'll leave up mana for Love at Art. End of turn, seek the beast. The place spell appears. How about a lava dart this now? Let's see, because I could like fetch and uh, bolt, but I would still need to get lucky and flip like a sorcery or a um, creature. Didn't have good. Okay then. Well, successfully swap is the beast, but you know my hand's still solid and feel good. I don't have the Lyrium, but I'm only missing a land. I guess I could turn it on with a loud art. That's not true, because I need instant at that point. Yeah, they just don't have removal spells. I wonder what they have, just iteration, probably. Iterations and counter spells, I guess that's what they have. So what exile. Consider, right, so you can go land consider. Mm hmm
you bottomed a DRC. Okay, so a graveyard. Draw. Nice. Do I want to play Questing Euroid or do I want to play Bren's Resolve? What's better? I guess I can actually play DRC, Bren's Resolve. Nah. Yeah, I think I actually want to hit a land drop, so I'm gonna go DR Silver and Resolve. Land Love at Art. And I can cast this in my opponent turn as well, so. I'll, uh, I'll do it. I'll, uh, you know, play around whatever Ragavan removals for Ragavan or whatnot. I know it's just good, like top plan on the turn. I don't, I don't have to play that Love of Arts now. I can wait next turn to give prowess to my Swiss Spear and such. Probably I don't. Though. Anyway, they have three spells only in the graveyard, so if they play Merc Tide, only Heat kills it. Unless they have a counter spell as well. Maybe that's actually their line here. Oh, can't do much about that. Is that 7-7 seven, seven Merc died? That's fine, I can go on only hit plus dart. I think that's a 7-7 seven, seven Merc died. And now they can't play a counter spell. I guess they can play Force of Negation. Probably don't mind. Yeah. Obviously, I'll just go top lane end of turn. Don't cast that dart. Alright, let's go. My turn. Delirium 2. I'll on top and play on the heat. Let's give that Force of Negation. I hope not. I guess I can play Soska Mage first, in case they... Nah. Uh, I like that. Hmm. Do I want to go Quest and Druid? Yeah. Cast that. What is it? Perfect. Bubble and land. Look at the value. And then I can play that uh, Lava Dart. Win everything. And then I can attack for three and play Solstrom. All the value. Top land on top of your deck. Two lava darts in the graveyard. Draw. Yep. Try to surveil uh, as well as possible by just I got like three lands in a row on top. But that's fine. I'm still a very ahead here. Did it go Fury? Fine. I'll, I've line and bolt for that. Do I want to lava dart face? Probably not. To surveil, probably not. I'd rather pump the questing druid. Play Questing Druid. Let's play Soska Mage. And let's play Lightning Bolt. How much damage do I have here? 
Mm, not enough. Hold those land in end. I don't have a stomping ground anymore, so this is just a mountain. Two dollar darts in my graveyard. Iteration, sure. All right, pretty satisfied with uh, this league. It started poorly, but we made some changes to the deck. And uh, we rattled off four wins in a row. Happy. It's not quite a trophy, but you know, for a brew, <laughs> four wins in a row is good. I mean, I guess you'd be like, oh, but that's not brew, it's not about deck. Yeah, but like, Prowess hasn't won anything in a while, and this list is a lot of different cards. Okay, so you want to deal six damage to that, and I can't do anything about it. I guess it's not technically over yet. Yeah, the question has been very good, I think. Duty, 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 duty. All right. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching this video. If you watched on YouTube. Um, if you haven't yet, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you next time. Brands Resolve is basically Reckless Simples. They are the same card. They decided to print uh, the same card twice. All right, let's go. I should not have any of those in my hand here. But it's okay. This isn't still solid. I'll start with a stomping ground. And uh, a so in general, you want to play a non-hasty threat on turn one if you have the option. Because, for example, let's say I play Lava Dart next turn, I can go like Swift Spear Lava Dart, and that's four damage. Whereas if I went turn one this Swift Spear Lava Dart, I would deal three damage. Okay, this this easily means Brennan six. So let's just uh, play the cards that survive the Brennan 6. And this is the same damage. If I play Swiss Spear on turn 1 or on turn 2, it would be the same damage. Ah, got punished for my change. This should have been a Brennan's Resolve. It would have been so good, so good, it would have been. Alright, let's play all my things. They're 14. What's that end of turn? Root Spiral. Oh wow, they can already play Archon of Cruelty? Oh my. Yeah, I lose to that. <laughs> it sucks that I lose to that because I have Lava Dart in my hand to kill the dwarf. So I have to go like fetch land creativity on the dwarf. Oh, they don't have it. That's great. Is that just a preordain? Nice. And next turn I can keep up Lava Dart. They bought them both. Alright, I might just play Fable here. Mm-hmm. Right, Fable is solid. Okay. I like this draw a lot. Can actually win the game here. 
I go on the Lee Heath, probably I can. Let's, let's try and see. My first spell of the game triggers five things. Pretty sure I'm gonna get Delirium and win the game here. All right, GG. Cool, cool, cool. My opponents almost turned three darkened me, but thankfully they they didn't. But they're close to do it. Now we're gonna play around that. I didn't expect Growth Spiral for sure. Okay, so I can bring in the explosives over a Noli Heat. That seems fine. Yeah, thankfully we won the spy drawing breach. Again, I mean my in my previous version I had zero of these and I had eight of Reckless Impulse Brands Resolve and Questing Droid, I guess twelve. But there was a game where I went through like forty cards to my deck and I lost against Mono Black Hoppers, and if I had Underworld Breach, I would have probably won. So just maybe finding one is, is alright. The problem with a breach is that if you flip it to the Reckless Impulse is really bad. So maybe my original uh, thought was actually correct, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. One lander. We have 20 lands. I kept twice a one lander earlier and I got, and I died with one land. We just want a mulligan. And like this. Good though, it's really good. Really good, and if I draw a second land. Nah, let's keep it. I have two draws. Let's keep it. Alpine will stop the mine, yes, but it would be card disadvantage. So I'm not up for it. I like Alpine Moon when it kills there's a saga on the spot or when it stops a certain deck like Balakut or Tron. That's it. Like they can still make uh, uh tokens via um uh um, table or whatnot. I'll go land source mage and pass. Explosives also triggers uh, monsters with spear. All right, they have a they have a good start. I need to draw land here. Land boom. Fail. I failed. Alright, I think I want to kill uh, the Brennan 6, and I'll do it in this way. There's games where Brennan 6 is irrelevant or where there are multiples, and now I just miss 4 damage, but I'm probably going to lose this game regardless. I maybe just need to get slightly lucky and hope they don't have that many lands, and Brennan 6 actually helped them a lot. Uh, Blood Moon is good, but this deck I don't think should play Blood Moon. I think you should play cheap cards. Teferi. Mm. Okay. And can I draw a land? Yes. Okay. Now, uh, I want to go... Maybe I just have to keep up Lava Dark, actually. Yeah. Have to keep Lava Dark. Thank you for the Prime Sub. Welcome, welcome. It's obviously a tough life to keep up mana, but I feel like we have to. And maybe this, this explosives is not very good. But I guess if you don't have land, you're just gonna lose regardless, most likely. Okay. Celestial Purge. 
Hey, I'm happy I attacked Brand. If your opponent is on 20, you should not attack face. Unless you play Burn. Table is fine. Can go on the heat. But it doesn't have lands, you see? The ran in six. Kill was good. They might have a Leland binding in end. Okay. I think we're gonna pass an old up questing druid. And of course Lava Dart as well. And explosives, I guess, yeah. Sure. I'm not gonna move here. It's not a great game to play, but like I don't expect to win this game. When it keeps all the cards, wow. Seek the beast end of turn. I reveal a land friends resolve. play Burns Resolve. And then I don't have to cast the cards or reveal here. Unlike Questing Druid, you can cast this next turn. I guess I'll cast uh do I wanna cast me Shores Bubble? No probably not. I'll do it all next turn. I can go like double Swift Spear me Shores Bubble. That's gonna be more damage. If they keep on killing my stuff, it's okay. At the end of the day we have uh, a lot of threats. What we care about is the the combo, the combo aspect of it. Although opponent is gonna flip the fable now, so they're able to to target it with the creativity. Oh, they play silence. Huh. <laughs> I guess we lose to that. Yeah. You have a flashback, but they have a, a door of fear. Might as well just let this resolve and. What's the cost of Flip Fable? Three. Flip cards of the same cost as the back front, at the front now. Yeah, not that silence what was needed your opponent. Okay, they have Iona. Good to know. Iona spell PRs. Okay, so they brought in extra silence. Okay. As I said, I wasn't going to win this game, so that's alright. Yeah. Feeling good, let's go. Okay, let's go. Ooh. The full range, either all the lands or no lands. Welcome to Magic the Gathering. All right, keep, I'll watch them. There's another word breach, which I somehow keep on drawing. I wish it was the other one again. Alright, let's go. Land DRC bubble, hoping for a second land and also for the divinations, which are the most important part of the deck. <laughs> Ocarus is a situation where I need both lands and spells. But I guess here we are. Okay, yeah, that's good. Now we need some lands. Land. Man, I feel like I've played, this is my, every match I played today with this deck, I got minus Creed. <laughs> I don't think there was a single match where I was able to play two lands on turn two. 
Is that Brennan 6? No? Okay, they don't have mine for Brennan 6. What is that? Just binding? Hmm. Weird land, then. Why didn't you get the... Land. Yeah, but fun cool. When will I play Teamer Merc died? When it updates a modern challenge. Usually I either play decks that uh, do decently in some tournaments, or deck that I brew myself, like this one. And when I play deck that, brew, that I brew myself, it usually sucks, and it's better that I don't do it. Sometimes, I still do it. All right, I feel like I'm gonna just attack the fairy and pass, keeping up the questing druid. I don't even think this deck sucks. I mean, it does, but like, I just wouldn't mind making a second land drop on turn two, you know? Buongiorno, Vini. I'm in, I'm in the stage of a delusional deck builder, where you build a deck that it's clearly bad, you lose, and then you blame variants for your loss. If you've ever built a deck in your life, you've come to this spot a lot. It's important to trust the results. I'm a big believer in believing results. Those people that be like, oh, low sample size, it doesn't matter. Then your whole deck doesn't matter. No, never mind, I didn't say that. Uh, you go ahead and play Stomping Ground, Brennan 6. Okay. Five cards, Scalding Tarn. Hmm. Let's go Questing Druid. Land, 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 land. Land. Oh, okay. Cool. I can actually win this game. It'd be very cool. It would be very cool if I can. Right, so what's the sequencing here? I do think I want to kill the Renan 6. And I don't have the Lirium though. Played Living Gen the, the other day. I should have went 5-0 with it. The one with Fury main. Fury is great. Why no mutagenic growth? It's pretty bad when you flip it off uh, for Atlas Impulse and Questing Druid. Like, it's situational. Like, you might not, not have creatures. You put as removal spells. Like, it's not a good card to play, like, first, you know. Anyway. I think I want to kill Bren. So I'm definitely going to go bolt Bren. Although, I also want to go DRC, I think. And Surveil. Yeah. I think Furies in Living Again, this is what I'm, what's going to put the deck, like, second or third now. Do, 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 do. All right, let's go. Stomping Ground, the RC Bolt. The RC. Oh, did they? Do they have a. Uh... Okay. Looking for Delirium. Creatures, Sorcery would be nice. Find a land, which I love. Give me those lands, thank you. And then attack Bren. Do they have another binding? They do. Okay. I pass. If they want to minus Bren on the RC, I'll uh, accept. He was supposed to play Soulscar Mage and not DRC. Maybe that was better. Oh wow, they plus. Okay. Silence. Yep. Yeah. Gonna get me again. 
Yeah, lost to Silence twice. Because, like, if they have Spell Pierce, Lavadar play, plays around Spell Pierce. It doesn't play around Silence, though. Okay. I am fine accepting this loss.